The Lagotto Romagnolo is a small to medium sized dog with thick curly hair and a bright and happy demeanor. The breed originated in Italy and was first used to hunt waterfowl. Since the 19th century, the dogs have been specifically bred to hunt a kind of underground tuber or fungi known as the truffle. These days, they also make relatively laid back and affectionate companions around the home. Their hypoallergenic coats are good for allergy sufferers, although these coats require a good deal of maintenance. Now without further ado, let's dive right into our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Legato Ramoniello. But before we start our list, we'd like to take a moment to express our thanks to all the original Legato owners in this video. The video would seriously not have been possible without them. So don't forget to check out these incredible dogs from the Instagram profiles that have been linked in the description below. And now, let's begin the list. Number 1. Their Origin and History The Legato Romaniello is a water retriever that originated in Italy. These curly-coated dogs were first used to retrieve waterfowl in marshes and lagoons. In fact, in the dialect of Romagna, the words can and lagot mean water and dog. Later, farmers and landowners began to use the dogs to seek out truffles, not the chocolate kind, but the fungi highly prized by chefs. The dog's keen sense of smell and protective tightly curled coats made them ideal to hunt truffles in wooded and thorny forests during fall and winter. By the 1970s, however, interest in the dogs had waned and the breed might well have disappeared. Fortunately, Italian dog lovers took steps to preserve them. In 1988, they founded the club Italiano Legato, and since then, interest in the breed has spread to many other countries including Australia, Finland, the Netherlands, Switzerland, and the United States. The American Kennel Club began registering the breed with its foundation stock service in 2001 and recognized the Legato as a member of the sporting group in July 2015. Number 2. Their Appearance Legato Romaniello looks an awful lot like their famous cousins, the Portuguese water dog. Of course, this makes sense, as both of these guys were originally bred as water retrievers meant to collect fowl for hunters. The Legato Romaniello is a breed of handsome dogs that commands a lot of presence. They are small to medium in size and quite squarely built which gives them a sturdy appearance. Their heads are moderately broad with dogs having slightly convex skulls and slight but noticeable stops. Eyebrow arches are well developed and muzzles are strung almost as deep as their long. Their jaws are powerful and large with tight lips covered in bristly long whiskers. Number 3. Their Coat Legato Ramoniello is considered to be one of the cutest dog breeds in the world, which has something to do with their beautiful, thick, and curly hair. Their coat is extremely waterproof and is wooly and rough to the touch. Their undercoat, on the other hand, is softer and dense. The curls form all over their body, but they are looser on their head, which form eyebrows, whiskers, and beards. The cheeks are nicely covered in thick hair, and their curls on their ears are kind of wavy and open. Inner ear flaps are also covered with hair, and tails are covered in bristly, woolly hair. Number 4. They have a great sense of smell. The Gato Romaniellos were originally bred to hunt truffles. Truffles grow underground and cannot be seen ripening. It can only be detected through the strong aroma of the mature truffle. These dogs boast a superb nose, and this is why the breed was very efficient in searching for truffles. They excel at nose work even today. Their strong sense of smell has been put to good use in many situations. A lot of these dogs make great search and rescue team members. Some are even used by the police or military as drug and bomb detection dogs or to sniff out certain medical conditions in people. Number 5. They make wonderful family pets. Although the Legato is first and foremost a working dog, they can surely make a perfect addition to your family. These dogs are known to be exceptionally good-natured around people and they love nothing more than to be a part of your family. These guys are affectionate and laid back as long as exercise is provided in the form of at least one good long walk per day and preferably a game of fetch. If those needs are met, Legato Romaniellos are generally content even when living in an apartment setting. These dogs also need companionship, so it's also important not to leave them home alone for too long. Without human companionship, you can expect to see plenty of unwanted behaviors as you would with any other breed. Also, if you have plants or prized flowers, it's best to keep those fenced in. If these plants catch the attention of your pet, you can be sure that these will be uprooted as the Legoto just loves to dig. Number 6. Their Protective Ability This breed is definitely known for its bark. And yes, if there are strangers around, a Logoto can be quite vocal. This makes them good watchdogs, but they certainly can't be your first choice as a guard dog. These guys are aloof with strangers, but it is very unusual for them to be aggressive. Some may even be quite timid. In short, these dogs may serve as decent watchdogs, but otherwise, they do not offer much protection. Number 7. Their Exercise Needs How much exercise does a Logoto Romagnolo need? 
more than you might think. Well, with their high energy levels and active spirits, they'll need plenty of physical and mental stimulation. These dogs don't need miles and hours of running exercise though. What they need is a decent sized fenced yard and frequent sessions of vigorous physical activity. Having been bred to be hunting companions, they still have not lost their ability to retrieve, so you can engage them in chasing down a toy in a rigorous game of fetch. Another excellent activity for these super fast athletes is the sport of agility, which is an obstacle course for canines. Also rally, obedience, musical freestyle, complex trick routines all work wonderfully for a Lagoto. Number 8. They are easy to train. Early socialization and training are vital to ensure that the Lagoto Ramoniello grows into a well-adjusted and well-mannered companion. This won't be a daunting task as the breed is pretty easy to train. These dogs are always happy to work with you. You just have to use a light hand on the leash and focus on establishing the right leader-follower relationship. But it has been found that some Lagotos are more independent and will use their intelligence to figure out how to do things the way they want to. This is why these dogs can sometimes be too clever or manipulative for a first-time owner. Number 9. Their Grooming Needs Lagoto Romaniellos have double coats that are water-resistant and are made up of hair rather than fur. This means that their hair grows more slowly, does not shed much, and tends to hold dander and allergens to the body rather than dispensing them into the environment. For this reason, Lagoto Romaniello is often referred to as a hypoallergenic breed. This trait comes at a price though, as their coats tend to mat more easily. Hair can grow thick around the eyes and ears, making it difficult for these dogs to see when they are not groomed. They can also develop infections or trap debris in the ears. This is why Lagoto Romaniellos must be brushed and groomed regularly. It's often recommended that the length of the coat be kept to 1 and 1.5 and inches. However, it is interesting to note that there is some disagreement on how the breed should be groomed. Some believe in regular brushing and trimming for neatness, while others believe in letting their coat's natural fluffiness show. Number 10. Their Health The typical lifespan of a Lagotto Ramoniello is 11 to 14 years. Well, overall, their health is good, but they are vulnerable to a few serious health issues. About 1 in 4 Lagotos is prone to hip dysplasia, which is a malformation of hip joint that causes pain and lameness and leads to chronic arthritis. The breed can also suffer from two different forms of epilepsy. One form appears in young Lagotto puppies and thankfully goes away in just a few months. The other appears in Lagotto adults and requires lifelong medication. Also, Lagotto storage disease is a breed-specific condition that is a serious neurodegenerative issue. Dogs affected by this condition will display a variety of neurological symptoms, which can include changes in behavior, problems with coordination, and facial and eye tics. If left untreated, it can ultimately lead to death. This is why the Canine Health Information Center mandates breeders to submit health evaluations of their breeding dogs and litter. Make sure you get your Lagotto from a certified breeder or animal shelter that can provide a reliable health background for your pup. And also remember to take your dog to the vet for a routine health checkup. Alright guys, that's the end of our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Lagotto Ramoniello. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you already own one of these vibrant dogs, let us know about their specific traits in the comments below. Please leave a thumbs up and share the video if you liked it. For more interesting facts on different dog breeds, click on our channel and don't forget to subscribe. See you guys in the next one.